It was a courtroom surprise yesterday. Pop star Usher taking the stand in an emergency hearing, fighting his ex-wife for custody of their two sons after one of them nearly drowned in Usher's pool. And it got very personal and emotional. ABC's Steve Osinsami was in the courtroom, and Steve joins us from Atlanta Live. Steve. Good morning, Bianna. The singer's five-year-old son is still hospitalized here, at least for another day, and the judge has ruled that when he goes home, he'll go home with his father to the very house where he nearly died. I don't know if my son is going to have a brain defect. I don't know that his heart is operating correctly. I don't know that my son is going to be 100% the boy he was. At this emergency hearing where Tamika Raymond hoped to win temporary custody of her two children with Grammy Award winner Usher Raymond. He doesn't answer the phone. He doesn't answer emails. The very frustrated ex-wife broke down listening to those 911 calls for Monday when her five-year-old son nearly drowned at the bottom of her ex-husband's pool. That is chaos. That is chaos. Her superstar former husband, who won custody of their kids last year, still wearing the wristband from his son's hospital. Just reacting as any father would, out of concern. Telling the judge that he and his people at the house did the best they could. When I got in the back of the ambulance, um, he was hysterical. I did my best to calm him down. I saw that he uh, was gasping for breath, so I, I known that he probably uh, took in um, a fair amount of water. Usher Raymond V had his hand caught in a pool drain after reaching for a toy. We learned in court he was under eight feet of water and that his father has video of the entire incident. Tamika Raymond questioned the ability of the aunt who was watching the children and who testified Friday. Rena Odin jumped in the pool but couldn't free the boy. She's a good person and a nice family member. A nanny? No. The judge disagreed, siding once again with the singer. Most of the people in this room have been cared for by a grandmother or an aunt. So I'm denying or dismissing the motion. Before he left court, he and his ex-wife embraced. Somehow these two have to work together. I will say, Mr. Raymond, in the future, you would be well advised to keep your former spouse informed about your whereabouts and who is taking care of the kids. In court, Usher was asked a very important safety question, whether he ever looked inside and saw the bottom of that pool. He answered that he had people who took care of that and he never noticed anything wrong. Dan and Bianca. Steve, our thanks to you, and it was nice to see that embrace at the end yeah, they, for no other reason than for their kids. They do share two kids, no question about it.